Yo, this is the judge from the almighty Wu-Tang Clan. Pro Tools, the long-awaited return from the Wu-Tang Clan's lyrical swordsman. Pro Tools, in stores August 19th on Baby Grand Records. It's hot right now. It's called Pro Tools. Got a couple of Wu brothers on there, various producers, you know, various artists, new features, banging tracks, hot lyrics as, as usual, as always. You know, something that's needed right now. Go get that. RZA, Master Killer, True Master, Wu Tang producer. Justice Kareem, my son. Rock Marcy, you know, good brother, lyricist. Brother named Ka from Brooklyn, you know, did a track for me. You know, he's featured on a solo track. Yeah, that's, that's basically it. True Master, RZA, Bronze Nazareth, J Wax. Black Milk, that pretty much sums it up. Dreddy, Dreddy came to me with some tracks for, from various producers, and um, I was feeling the tracks, and I decided to use them. That's how the producers came in. It's not like I sat down and I picked and choose what producers I wanted to use. If the track is hot, then I'll use it. And, um, Dreddy was presenting me some songs and beats that were on CDs, and they just happened to be from several producers and I was feeling this track. I mean bronze, I, I know bronze anyway. You know, we got a little history together. So um, that's how that came I got there's a few on there that stand out that I like. I mean I don't know if they're actually favorites but I like um, I like the zero percent finance track. I really like that one because it's 104 bars, no interruption, straight through. It took a while to put that together as far as writing. And um, that's one that's one that I like to listen to a lot. I also like the Alphabet track. I like the energy on that. But I, I like the whole album, but those are two that I listen to. It's just a track, man. Right? Just a dart that I wrote a couple seven months before the album was even done. And it was the first that just needed to be it's not not personal. It's just a dot. Good one too. Yeah, paper plates. Lightweight. That's not as lyrical as it used to be many, many years ago, but I mean, whatever the people like, they want to get, they're feeling it, and that's what it is. I mean, it's changing all the time. It's forever changing. Like I said, it's not as lyrical as it used to be. The music is quite different. The game has changed. Tones and, and online and downloading, and, you know, it's, that's changed a lot in hip hop. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. I keep it lyrical. Though. I keep it lyrical. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be on the Liquid Source tour, or should I say, I'm out on the Liquid Source tour right now, performing that album, classic album. Fans, you know, love to see me perform that. I mean, it started around a year and a half ago. Pitchfork Festival in um, Chicago. I was asked to go out there and perform at um, Liquid Swords, the Liquid Swords album. And then ever since then, I've been doing Liquid Swords shows. And now Liquid Swords tour. I'll stay on the road anyway. But Wu Tang was out. You know, the response is still been great. The crowd is just goes crazy. It's, it's just we have a following that's unbelievable. Wu Tang and. It's always good to get that love, of home and abroad, you know, in the States and overseas. It's a good thing. They still throwing that W up. And W is, you know, it's a brand right there.